and welcome to another reroll tutorial video. Today we are going to build a crawler robot, but since just calling it a crawler robot is a little bit boring in my opinion, I think we are going to call it Juan, which is the ghost that climbs out of the television. So I hope this one will be a little bit more interesting because actually this robot is able to crawl in a lot of different ways. So we are going to explore how we can make crawl and the crawling, me crawling mechanism and all that. So let's get started. Now to make your own Juon, you need 8 rotatable connects, 10 interconnects, 6 double spacers and 2 single spacers, and 5 adapter joints. Also we need the controller, 4 U-joints, 4 long U-joints, 8 servos, 1 cube joint, and the head module. We are going to start with the feet and the hands. So to build one, we need one long U-joint, one normal U-joint, two servos, two rotatable connects, and one interconnect. So first, connect the U-joints to the servos. So they're both the same. Slide in a rotatable connect on the opposite side of the upper connect, and then slot in the U-joint. Do it the same for the other one. Okay. Now, on the end of the, sh of the normal U-joint, Connect the interconnect. Then slide in the, the servo that is connected to the long U joint like so. So it can so let's say it is brought from the side of the robot, then you can move forward, backwards, and then you can lift up and then put it down again. So this is the design for the limb. So duplicate three more. We are done. Now we are going to start to build the body. So as always we are going to use the controller as the base. So this is the front and this will be the side. So we will slot in an adapter joint, the side. Then one double spacer, one single spacer and then finish it with an adapter joint. Repeat with the other side. So we need the adapter joint at the ends because that is where we will, we will connect the limbs like so okay now for the front slide in two double spacers first and then the adapter joint this is so that the adapter joint will end up in the middle so you can connect the head so now slide in interconnects into all the adapter joints one two Three, four, five. Okay. Now for the head, slide in the cube joint, the interconnect, and then finally the head module. So here's the slot. Here's the interconnect. Slide it. Okay. Now for the legs, just slide in them. Slide them in one. Three and four, and we are done. Once you're done with building the robot, remember to set the limits for the servos. So for this part, it has to be like this from here, here, ninety degrees, and then for this part, this servo is also ninety degrees. So do it for all four limbs and then remember to connect the wires and use the wire clips if you have to. So now for the task for this video, you have to think of a way to teach a robot how to move. So this is the sample. It actually uses the same walking principle. So as you can see a leg lifts and then pushes down. So it's, very, so it's around the same principle but as you can see it's a modified version because the servo placement is different. So try to think of how to write the program and then in the next video we are going to use a real animator to program the Duon robot but I'm going to show you a new trick that you can use with the real anim animator to speed up the progress that you teach the robot. That's all for today, thanks for watching. Thank you.